Even during vacations, North Korean students cannot live freely. They are required to attend school regularly and participate in organized activities, such as the Children's Union and the Youth League. These activities mainly involve reading propaganda books, engaging in physical exercise, and completing homework. At times, they may also be mobilized for forced labor, such as farming. If there's heavy snowfall during the winter break, students are compelled to attend school and clear the snow. Some students even roam the streets collecting scrap materials, each with a predetermined quota that must be donated to the labor party. If they fail to collect enough scrap, they must continue collecting materials during their vacations. North Korean students do not have the freedom to go on extended vacations, as they are required to periodically attend school to prove they have not left the country. This restriction on movement reflects the lack of freedom of movement in North Korea.